What's going on everybody? This is Kill Nasty, and as you can see, we're back again. It's that time of the month or the week or whatever, not in a bad way, in a good way. It's that time for another prestige video. Uh, as you can see, oh, hello Deception. Get out of the way. You're, all, you're, you're covering up my name. Hold on. Just wait. There you go. I am 4th prestige level 80. Uh, I believe I was 4th. I am so intense, and I have a cat as my emblem. So, um, yeah, we'll go through this. Somewhat fast. Oh, wait, no, no, no. I gotta start with the stats first. I always start with the stats. Um, yeah, there you go. You can kind of pause it if you want. Um, not a whole lot has changed. Once again, same win streak. Um, KD keeps going up a little bit at a time. We've got a 1.53 now. Um, like I said, that slowly increases over time thanks to these amazing FPS freaks that I have. Um, headshots, whatever. You don't care about that. Accuracy, I don't even know what that was last video. I think it's gone up. Um, I've been using a lot of the single shot weapons, so can been get a little bit more accurate. Um, I still have that 24 kill streak. I actually haven't gotten another Moab since that one, so uh, I'm working on it. I've I've had a lot of close ones in infected game mode, and um, a couple close ones in just regular other game modes by myself or whatever. And uh, about four days and five hours to get here. Um, maybe a little bit less. I've been kind of playing some other game modes even after I've been able to prestige. But uh, yeah, just noticed that I was able to. So um, yeah, thought I'd do the video. Go to the leaderboards real quick, kind of show where some of my friends are. Uh, yeah, there you go. You can pause it. Ooh, Merka Durka. Oh, wait, where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh, there's Merka Uh Yeah, hey, what up, Merka? Um, yeah, so there. Compare me to Merka. Where am I? I'm down right here. He's up there. He's got a lot more time played than me, but um, yeah, whatever. Beside the point. Um, don't think anything else really matters. Those are all just random stats. So now we'll get to the good stuff. Create a class. Um, a lot has actually changed this prestige. I did kind of trying out new weapons and stuff like that, as you'll see through the classes. Um, this is a very underrated weapon, in my opinion, the MK-14, because um, I noticed that I have lately been starting to just get absolutely destroyed by people that use this gun. So, uh, like always, when I start getting destroyed by a gun, I start using it, getting better with it. And uh, the MK-14 is one of those guns that is just phenomenal. If you have even a semi-decent trigger finger or speed-wise, whatever, I am no, um, like, insanely fast. I've had people ask me for some reason if I have a mod. Actually, hang on, I think I still have a message. Um, I do not have a mod um, for my controller or anything like that. Yeah, see, here you go. Here you go. Where did you quit your mod? Um, I think he meant to say get your mod. Um, and I was like, eh, no, I don't have a mod, I just use FPS Freaks, because I thought he was talking about, like, an aimbot or something. He's like, nobody can shoot that fast. So, yeah, I can shoot that fast, so suck it. Um, but yeah, this is my class. I like this a lot. If you haven't tried the MK-14, and you've kind of like single-shot weapons, stuff like that, then this is really good. It's only two shots for a kill, basically. Like, no matter where you hit them, um, as long as they don't go into final stand, which sucks, because then it's three shots. Um, but two shots a kill, that's a really good kind of trade-off for not being able to just spray and pray without hitting the trigger a lot. So, definitely a suggestion to take in. Uh, this is also a new setup that I tried. I just tried this, like, starting at level 72 or so, and as you can see, it's really paid off with these weapons. They're both really high weapon levels, or not really, really high, but pretty high weapon levels for just starting at level 70. Um, I just kind of wanted to try overkill for once. I've It's usually the perk that I don't get pro. So uh, I figured that what I would try was start out with a shotgun, a striker. I've tried a couple different shotguns, but um, I don't know. I just really haven't done well with any other than the striker. And then um, since I don't always, it's not always close quarters combat and stuff with um, shotguns on every map, I decided that I put on an SMG for the secondary for overkill. And uh, ump is always a good one to choose. The higher weapon level you get with it, the better it is, like every gun. But um, I found myself really struggling at first with the ump, but then once I got uh, Overkill Pro and was able to put an attachment and the proficiency on it, I started doing really well with it. So this is definitely a setup to try. Specialist really helps on this too, because then you're able to get scavenger and all that for your ammo uh, for the different guns and stuff. So, yeah, that's that. Um, big Boom, this is my Explosives class, or, well, my Javelin class in C4. Um, I, I tried the AK-47 for once. I don't think I've really actually tried it, any of the other prestiges. Um, because you get it so late in the game, I haven't really just tried leveling it up or anything like that. But um, I, I was a big fan of the AK in Modern Warfare 2. For some reason, uh, I only do Red Dot Sight on the AK. I, I guess if I had extended mags, I'd do that. But a lot of people say that they like Silencer um, because they just don't mind the Iron Sights. But for some reason, I don't do well with these Iron Sights. So uh, just... 
Slap a red dot on there. Good as new. And uh, actually not good as new. Good as... Be or better than new. Whatever you want to say. Better than stock. Better than default. So, uh, Javelin's a must-have for me. I, I love just... Yeah, Javelin, Overdrop Zone, Bombsite, anything like that. Domination Flag and just... Quad! But, yeah. Moving on to the next one. We've got the good old MP5. This is the highest... I or not MP5. Sorry. MP7. Uh, I think this is the highest that I've gotten this gun with the Prestiges. Got my silencer and extended mags. I, don't, I might have gotten this higher, actually. I don't know. I, I just can't remember if I've ever used extended mags or not. So, uh, MP7 is usually one that I like to run specialists with because I like rushing around with this gun, kind of getting up in their spawn, in their faces, and uh, pwning some noobs, as they say. So, specialist really helps me out with that. It's a good way to get all the perks and whatnot. Um, G18s is actually something that I tried new this prestige as well. The G18s were known for being very, 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 very overpowered in Modern Warfare 2, especially when you had a Kimbo, because uh, the clips were so damn big. So, uh, I figured I'd stick with uh, some overpowered weapons to try them, but no. In this game, they are not overpowered at all. If anything, the FMG9s are way overpowered compared to these. So, uh, it was a little difficult at first when I just had one of them trying to get uh, akimbo, but once I got the akimbo, these are kind of fun to just rush around with. If you're close enough, then um, you'll kill them fast, but these really aren't good at long range for spraying like the FMG9s. So, I don't know, if you like trying out new guns, this is something to try. And wow, this is this is the farthest I've gotten with the Type 95 too. I think um, I don't know. I just I really like the Type 95. Say what you want. It's it's overpowered. Whatever they've nerfed it and they continue to nerf it because somehow it still remains overpowered even after they fix it. So this is just kind of my take out kill streaks as you can see there. Kill streaks. No, uh, this is what I use to take out kill streaks and enemy support. So I don't know. I just really like this setup with the Type 95. When I had red dot and extended mags. I was able to kind of consecutively get kills without having to reload since I didn't have sleight of hand. So it was really nice for that. I also had silencer on this for a while, but I just kept getting so many dang hit markers with bursts and stuff like that that I got sick of it. So when I got uh, extended mags, I decided to slap that on there. So I'm sure a lot of you have tried the Type 95 before though, so that's beside the point. Uh, I don't know if I'll be using it as much next prestige. I like to kind of switch up my guns and whatnot, so we'll, we'll just have to see. You have to come back for the next one. And uh, wow, this is the farthest I've gotten with any sniper rifle. I can say that with certainty because uh, I normally suck at sniping. I usually don't try because I get frustrated because, I, I don't know, for some reason my copy of the game just doesn't come with quickscope snipers. Um, or I just, like I said, I suck. I'll admit it. But uh, I don't know. I just, I enjoyed sniping. I, I like to snipe. I do it kind of do. Just relax and not have to worry about all the crap that happens whenever I try to rush and get killed by campers. So I do a little bit of camping, quote unquote, myself when I snipe. And I don't know, I just like sniping. So uh, the Barrett was the only one that I seemed to really be able to do well with. I know the MSR is obviously an amazing sniper, but you don't get it till way late in the game. So um, Barrett is in Infected, and I started to kind of level that up early and get attachments and stuff like that. And then I just started to use it kind of in kill confirmed and domination stuff like that and as i leveled it up i realized that i was enjoying it a lot more so yeah that's the farthest that i've gotten a sniper and specialist on a sniper is a really good way to go as well because uh i don't know then you're able to rush around even though i said i like to camp it's nice to kind of be able to run all the way around the map and place yourself based off where they're spawning so yeah i got some elite snipes and uh yeah that's it really for classes you can go back through either try out some of my classes or anything like that. If you have suggestions or uh, maybe a challenge of a class that you would like me to try, please tell me in the comments because um, I wouldn't mind doing a video, uh, a video a week or something like that or a couple series where you guys pick a class. It can be completely random. It can be an amazing class. It can be a terrible class. Um, but I want you guys to give me kind of some suggestions, a full-on class, Make a lineup for me, and I will try those out. Try to get a good gameplay or something with them, and record it as a live commentary or something like that. Maybe you'll get to see me rage a shitload in one game, or I will just absolutely destroy face like I do with this gun in uh, a game. So yeah, if you have a suggestion for a class, tell me in the comments below, and I will be sure to take those into consideration. So now we got the good part. We're going to prestige. Yep, more info. Last chance. I don't care. Enter that prestige. Booyah, motherfucker! Uh, I think this is 5th. Uh, I don't even remember at this point. I, I, I'm assuming I just came from 4th. I don't think this would be 6th because I definitely didn't get through 6th prestiges in 4 days. So, uh, if this is correct, this is 5th. 
I, I don't know. I have two tokens, but I really just don't want to spend them on anything right now. Because I don't want to do unlock gear. I have like the starting weapons that I want. And I'm going to actually save this double XP token. Because uh, I have a feeling that's what I'm going to use it on eventually. But these first levels are always so easy and so quick. Um, so I think I'm just going to save it for later on when I get to the later levels. Or the middle levels of this prestige. And uh, we'll see what happens from there. But yeah, that's it for now guys. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. And if you did, please show me by leaving a thumbs up. It helps me out a lot. It lets me know what you guys like. And it also helps my channel grow. Um, but yeah, that's it for now. Like I said, look forward to some more videos in the future here. we got some good stuff coming up. And I will catch you guys later. Peace!